got some of this unpoppable bubble wrap, and it's unpoppable, so we have to have fun other ways. Press this one, it goes to that one. I'm gonna try popping it now. Nope, not gonna happen. Oh, now we have lost all the air. Can't believe you bubble wrap makers making unpoppable stuff. Guys, welcome back to another episode by Brennan World, and today is Thanksgiving, and um, yeah, so. I'm in my room downstairs and upstairs my mom and dad are starting to make the turkey and we also bought two pies and I just finished making like a cherry cheesecake. It looks pretty good though, but um see what time is it? Eleven eleven. So yeah, um so there's my clock. And you may have noticed that there's no big lamp here anymore, but if you guys, I don't know if I've told you guys yet, but that lamp that was right there, it actually broke. Like, you could, oh yeah, I did tell you. Yeah, the string thing, the pulley thing, it wouldn't pull anymore. Like, um, it just wouldn't turn on or off. But, so that's my new setup here. As you can see, I, I couldn't put the pins in that lamp. So I took the pins and put them in this lamp, which makes it look like ten times better than just a little red lamp. <laughs> um, but... So yeah, it's my new setup right here, which I actually kind of like because it's pretty cool. Um, cause it, I'm, I angled the speaker cause there wasn't anywhere for it to go. But I actually angled the speaker so you can actually see both of the speakers through all of that. But, and then I actually have a permanent charging dock now for my drone. I just keep it plugged in right there. As you can see, I just got done playing with him a little bit ago. So that's red and then I just wrapped the wire around here and then I just set them on my new lamp to charge. This is pretty much just for looks because, or if I get a new, a longer auxiliary cord, because that's as long as it gets and I can't set my tablet anywhere up here, but it's, that's like as far as it reaches, so, I don't know. As of right now, that's pretty much just for looks, so I'm probably just going to take that HDMI, or that auxiliary cord out just to make it look a little better, not have wires over it. But yeah, so that's my alarm clock with the projector if you can kind of see that but um so yeah uh this is my new lamp um basically my me and my dad don't like the ones where you have to like pull them um because they seem to break the quickest um but i like the ones that are either buttons or like twist and as you can see this one right here is push to turn on so yeah but this one is actually you just turn this little knob on the thing that so it's pretty cool it's actually like completely pitch black but then it actually turns white with like an outline of dark gray uh so yeah sorry my little brother came down and i don't know if he was coming in but um so yeah it's a really cool lamp i just got it for walmart and it was like i think it was like 12 dollars um but it said if you have this on for three hours a day, it lasts for like a year and a half, but, um, because usually I keep, I usually, my old lamp, I had on for a long time every day, but now I use this one mainly because usually a day I would <laughs> use it for like eight hours. Um, so now I'm only going to use this one like when I'm reading or maybe just like before I go to bed or something, but as you can see, pretty good light. Um, if you want to see it with the lights off, it is day, so it doesn't look exactly how it does at night, but. So yeah, that's how it looks. Pretty good lighting. Um, it's not the same as my old one. It doesn't, like, provide light for all of the room. Mainly just in one spot, but as you can see, it lights up everything pretty much just as good as my last one, but I didn't think we could find a lamp just as good as my last one, but this one's actually better because, as you can see, if we turn it off, it completely like perfectly matches my alarm clock because it's like black and silver and this is black and silver and also it's really cool is all the way up it's um you can actually bend it as you can see it's kind of bent right there um you can actually bend it to, and position it where you want that's just where i want it um and we just have that light bulb in there which is a pretty good light bulb but um it's really cool also because my old lamp as you know was just like a lamp i really like the lamp shade but this one it also had it only had one outlet 
as you can see, this lamp is way better because it's actually an organizer lamp. It has two outlets. Also, I have this little night light that has a little sensor, so that's really cool. And I don't know if I really showed you that. Hopefully it works during the day, but it looks really awesome. Um, when this turns on, that's... I wish I could... Eventually I'm going to have to show you when it's like pitch black in here. It looks really awesome because when the night light's on at night... It's like dark everywhere else, but the nightlight like just lights up this peak, this speaker, and that one. So like, all you can see over here is like the time in both those speakers, and that's pretty much it. But it looks really cool because all you can see is like the two speaker things. But um, yeah. So it also has a little pen holder in the very back, which I just have my favorite type of pen right here, little Uniball Signo. Um, and then it has two holders. The bigger one is for a book. Which, it is like perfect size for Diver Wimpy Kid and stuff. And then the second one is actually a tablet holder. I don't use it for my tablet because, uh, first off, mine has a case so it can only fit in that one. And also it doesn't really have enough space. And also it, for books and tablets, I don't usually use it for that because I just feel that it's like kind of squeezing it too much. Um, and also the tablet was kind of leaning forward and I didn't want it to break the screen or anything. And then these are two extra little holders. Uh, I don't really know what they're for, but I know a lot of people use them for their desks. So I think they're kind of for like those little erasers or something um so technically what i say is uh this lamp i really like because it has like two outlets a pen or a pen holder tablet and book holder and then two eraser holders it also has that little silver and thing right there so that's my new lamp and that's my new setup and then i also have my other little speaker right there which is pretty much my phone dock right there so yeah, it's starting to look really awesome there with like my Minecraft corner with my industrial tech project, especially my clock right there. And then also all my cars with that. Oh yeah, I just checked the views on this little review for this thing. And sadly, this little tiny thing is getting us the most views, I think. Probably now it's at about 1,200. I noticed it goes up. 100 views every three or four days and last time i checked it was actually at a thousand a thousand one hundred seventy so thanks for that i can't believe that's at a thousand views that's pretty crazy because like other than that my most viewed video is like 600 i think um i have quite a few videos that have reached over over 100 or 200 now i i know even my drum set video the 200th video is at i think yeah that reached 100 views now so that's like at 115 so thanks for like that thousand views on there. Um, we're almost to the thousand two hundred. And also, I checked, and we literally need a hundred fifty more views to reach six thousand views overall. So let's get to six thousand views, and maybe we can reach that. Maybe we can reach six thousand views the same time we reach a hundred subscribers. So that'd be pretty awesome. And we're actually, we only need about a. a we only need about 4,150 before we reach 10,000 views, so that's really awesome. So yeah, um, this probably won't be it for the rest of it. I'm probably gonna, um, I'm probably gonna film a little bit of how the Thanksgiving dinner table looks before we eat and all the food and everything, because we have like three pies, or we have two pies and a cheesecake, and also we're just gonna have a lot of food, so. I'll add a little clip of that in there. I'll add a little after in there. And then this. So, yeah. So that's it for now, and I'll see you in a little bit. Oh, I took your chair. It's okay. Damn, it's the girl to me in Hell's Bell. Except you do it. If you had one of those boroscopes, you can just put... So we finished Thanksgiving. I couldn't get a before shot because everything was, like, all hot, and everyone was trying to get around and set it, but... I made the cheesecake and the mac and cheese um, and just a second ago we were using my smart camera app where you can set up a camera and then look at what it's filming from your tablet and actually take a picture and zoom in and we were taking pictures of them and we were spying on them because they were just talking up there because we just finished dessert but the past two things were was after dinner which pretty much looked the same as before we started eating and then the before shot of my cheesecake. We also had pumpkin pie but I don't really like pumpkin pie. Yeah I don't but like it. But we had a before a shot of my che my cherry cheesecake and my chocolate Hershey's pie. But we were gonna film us spying on us <coughs> on them with this, but then it disconnected. So yeah, that didn't really work out. But so yeah, that's it for the Thanksgiving vlog. Hopefully you guys liked it. And um, 
yeah, so next, the next holiday vlog will be uh, Christmas. So, hopefully you guys had a good Thanksgiving. Is there anything you have to say? Okay, yes. so make sure to like and subscribe, and I'll see you all later. Bye. Like this has been a Scale Lab Productions.